guys, today we will be doing multiplication. It is very hard by multiplying a big number with a big number. But multiplying with a big number with a small number is easy. So now, mm, uh, so now we can get into it. And don't forget to subscribe, like, and share this video. Now, now let's really get into it. I'll write the heading here. Mm, so, mul, mul, Won't you go in there? Line to separate it. Separate it. Okay. Now we will start from one times one digit to times two digit to times three digit. So first, let's do. Uh, why don't we do a two digit times a one digit, then a three digit times a two digit, then a four digit times uh, three digits. Yeah, that's good. First, let's do 50. I'll use a different color, like super bright for this. I mean, super dark. Let's do 56. That looks weird. I never drew a five like that. 56. Times what? Why don't we do eight? Eight is pretty friendly enough. Pretty even. So six times eight. Ouch! Drop my marker. Right on my feet. Okay, eight times six. Uh, eight, sixteen, thirty-two, and then. 32 plus 8 equals, yeah, it's 48. 8, you, so you gotta draw the 8 here and the 4 here. Uh, kind of in the middle. Okay, not in the middle, but like, it was in the middle. And then next, you gotta do 5 times 8. Or 8 times 5. It's better 5 times 8, because that equals 40. And then you gotta add this with the 40. So you write the 40 here, if you need to, plus the 40 four here that equals 44 I don't I know you guys don't need to write that down because that's super easy and then this is the and whoops oh look now this is combined yay and the answer is 448 I don't know why I spaced it out four four there the answer is 448 now it's quick. Okay, let's go into a next one. This time we're doing a two digit. Okay. Now we're doing a two digit number. I mean a three yeah, a three digit number by a two digit number. Why don't we do three hundred and thirty? Uh, six times a uh, two digit number that will be uh, sixty five. Okay, earlier, earlier I did fifty six. Okay, six times five or five times six that equals thirty. We write the Oh, and don't forget to put a circle because this will remind you of something. You gotta put a zero here, yeah, and then a three here. You gotta, when you do the answer here, you gotta move up and then to the left. And then next, we gotta do five times three, that equals 15, plus another three right here, that equals 18. Okay? Mm, so we gotta draw the eight there, and then the one here. Okay, four eighteen, and then after that we gotta do five times three again. That equals uh fifteen plus one equals sixteen. You.
we read the six here perfectly because we got it line it up perfectly zero with here eight six like that and then we got 16 right six there and then we gotta keep the space out one 16 eight zero but that is not our answer that is totally way off from our answer way less okay now what you want to do is you will want to erase this because you'll get a bit confused when we do this so and if you need to you can remind yourself by drawing another circle on six and we're doing it not on five okay now next we gotta do six times six i'll we know it's 36 we write the six here not here not like anywhere else like six there and then the three uh goes mm, so when we do the answer it's here so six times six we did the answer in here the six so we got to turn left and then we put the three here because that's the number we're going next to so then after that we're going to do s that looks more like a weird thing and then six times three that equals uh 18 plus another three that equals 21 so what you want to do is write the two here and then once where we did the mm, actually no no 20 oh yeah yeah, yeah. 21 we gotta draw the one here actually yeah one i forgot and then where you did the answer here we gotta mm, mm, turn left again and we put the two here because that's where we're going next we just done this so we're going next to this one and then we wrote our answer there now we gotta do six times three that will be 18 plus two that equals b that will be 20 so then you write the zero there and then the two there like that you'll see it has an extra one right there mm. and then after that you have no more numbers to circle so that's really it but this is not your answer 2016 1680 no you gotta add these together well not like normal add you don't put the plus sign there but not even the equal sign it's not like zero plus six like that it's zero and then you got a plus here that there's nothing here so that's gonna be zero so zero plus zero equals zero then eight plus six that will be eight plus five equals thirteen plus one equals 14 yeah 14 you put the four there and then the one up here it got cut by the line but don't worry and then six plus two because one here and one here so six plus one equals seven plus another one equals eight write the eight down there one plus zero that equals one and then zero plus two or two plus nothing or zero equals two so that's your answer it's pretty easy to me so that's a big answer 336 times 65 equals 21,840 okay now we're gonna do four digits and three digits here so let's move on to four digits by three digits okay let's erase this uh, making funny noises there i'm gonna choose a different no actually i'll choose no i'll choose red red is pretty is that dark yeah that's pretty dark but second i think green is the second darkest but I mean the third darkest and this the fourth darkest. Okay, now it's stop talking about colors. We're gonna do four thousand three hundred and twenty-one times. Why don't we do the same exact thing but like one, two, three, like the opposite? So three, two, one. That's pretty easy. 
gosh, should I say? Okay. And once again, you gotta circle the number if you if you want to keep yourself reminded. So three times one equals three. Three times two equals six. Three times three equals nine. And then three times four equals twelve. Uh, you gotta draw the two right underneath the four, and then the one right here. I'll make it extended, and then after that, you're done with the three. That was pretty quick. It's three, six, nine, two, one. I mean twelve. That was twelve. I can't write like. Okay, I'm now done with the three. Now let's go to the two. Okay. Uh, let me put the like this. Uh, one times two equals two. We gotta write it just like here. Two times two equals four. Two times three equals six, as you know. And then two times four equals eight. Uh, okay. There were no of that. Okay, now we're done with that. Uh, we can erase that. Uh, write the two back. And then now we're circle the one. It's literally the same exact answer. One times one equals one. One times two equals two. One times three equals three. And then one times four equals four. For some reason, this one... Oh wait, this has five. And then this one has four, but then it's going this way. And then this one has to go this way, and it's four. So, yeah, that makes sense. You know? So, yeah. That makes enough sense. If you know what I mean. And then, we gotta add those together. 3 plus 0 plus 0 equals 3. 6 plus 2 plus 0 equals uh, 8. 9 plus 4. Or should I say 9 plus 5 because 4 plus 1 here equals 14, I guess. Uh, 2 plus... Actually, let's 2 plus 2 equals 4, plus 6 equals 10, plus 1 equals 11. Wait, let's write the 1 there and the 1 up there. Uh, 8 plus 3 equals, huh, 11? Yeah, 11 plus 1, 12, plus 1, 13. Uh, yeah, 1 plus 0 plus 0 plus 4. Okay, that's the answer. <laughs> that's a very, 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 very big answer. 531,433. Well, that makes sense. 1 times 3 equals 3. And then 2 times 4. 2 times 2 equals 4. And then I think you double that or something equals 8. I don't really know. So that is really how you do multiplication. I did it in a way that you don't get like any of the numbers at the top but you can figure it out with the the two digit ones like it's just the same exact thing you just mm, when when you write it and it's like a two digit then you, you're doing two times one well make it like five plus five or i mean like i don't know like five times two that will be ten where I, okay, you figure it out, but this is going to be the end of this video, so see you till the next video. Bye! And don't forget to subscribe, like, and share this video. And thanks for watching. Now let's say goodbye. Bye!